Home prices are falling, home prices are falling. My name is Preston Soto, Grounded Real Estate Team Leader. I'm here for your September 2021 market update. So when we like to dive into these numbers, we like to see exactly where the market's going. That way we can help establish credibility and be able to advise all of our buyers and sellers as far as where the market's really going. As you know, if you've been following, we've been seeing the market continually rise up. We've definitely seen it slow down over the last few months. And this is something that I look at very, very carefully. So when we look at September's home prices, we actually saw that the average purchase price was about $328,000, 73 houses. This is single family, condos, and investment properties that sold all throughout the Imperial County. So 73 with the average day on market 22. So we like to compare these to the previous month as to where they were so we can kind of figure out where they're going. So looking back at August of 2021, our average purchase price was about $334,000 and pretty steady. We sold 74 houses. So pretty stagnant, but the bigger number, like I said, it was $334,000 as the average price. So we've seen the prices actually drop 1.7%. Um, so this was, you know, set off a light bulb and I was like, okay, well, that's interesting. We've seen this before. So we've seen this before. So looking back to a few months ago, um, the next month, it still went up another 5%. So I was like, okay, maybe we didn't hit the plateau that I was looking for. Um, so what I decided to do was to go back to July's numbers and compare them to August and September. So looking at July, we actually saw 91 houses sold in July. Um, so we're down 18 houses all throughout the Imperial County and the average purchase price at that time was $336,000. So this shows that we're on a downward trend over the last two months from where we were in July. Um, that's a total of 2.5% decrease since July. So obviously we're still selling houses at really high top dollar. Um, it just shows that maybe we've hit the apex and are just kind of slowing down a little bit. Um, you know, we're definitely seeing in the marketplace that buyers are able to get their offers accepted, whether it's a contingent offer, um, it's definitely softening up and that's personal experience still working with buyers out in the field. So the conversation we're having with sellers is like, hey, maybe you're not going to get 10 offers like we were seeing in the middle of the summertime, but maybe you're still going to get two to three offers. Maybe your house is going to be on the market, you know, closer to a month, which is what a normal market looks like out here in Imperial County. So just moving forward, you know, we've still, if you would have bought in last year at this time, you're still seeing 18% increase on your money in equity. Um, so definitely was still a great purchase. Um, it just looks like maybe the market's just slowing down a little bit and that it's going to be a great time that if you're not living in your dream home and you currently have a mortgage, what's your crazy offer me a number to sell my house price? It might be the time right now to start looking. That way you can see how much equity you're sitting on and you can move that money into your dream home. If you're interested in getting any of these details or looking for some more information on what's going on in the Imperial County marketplace, Feel free to get in touch with me at 760-457-9281. Direct message me, anything you need. Uh, contact myself, anybody on our team. We're more than happy to help. Hope you guys have a great October. Um, everyone be safe, and we'll talk again soon.